Welcome back to my channel. I'm back. Oh hey, fancy seeing you here. I am so excited to be filming this video today. It feels so strange to me to be stood in front of a camera again talking to you guys. I have missed you all so, so much. I'm not gonna go into like massive explanations on this video, but basically I have been extremely unwell since the back end of January. I've had lots of hospital trips, lots of hospital um, tests and doctor's visits and been back and forth for a really long time. I haven't been working at all. And I've just, yeah, I've been very unwell. It wasn't COVID, um, or we don't really know if it was COVID. It could have been COVID. There was a lot going on. But basically, I was really, really poorly. Um, and I am, <laughs> I'm getting there now. I like, the safest is like the best level. I'm kind of, I'm still down here, but I'm working my way up and I will get there eventually. So I wanted to film a video today to sort of, reintroduce my channel again I suppose and also I've got a cherries haul to share with you so cherries ever so kindly messaged me and asked me if I would like to um have some credit on their sh their store on their store to do a shop <laughs> so of course I said yes so I have got a little cherries haul to share with you as well so the first thing that I will address first because I know no the second thing that I'm going to talk about uh, because I know somebody will notice it and be like what is wrong with you this I've got a little friend here I've got a little injury I've got one here on my thumb can you even see that so the other day I was using some shears pattern cutting shears and I ended up cutting through my thumb a little bit so that was really sore and then last night I was cutting my dog's claws with these little clippers and they were really scared of the clippers so I was like pretending to clip my own nail and be like oh look they're not scary they are scary because I caught my own finger with it and took a chunk out so that is extremely painful and I know it looks like a bit dramatic for a cut but it's quite a deep cut and it's very sore, so hopefully I don't knock it on anything today because otherwise whew, it really hurts. Today's video is mainly going to be just saying hi with you all again and touching base and filming my cherries haul. I would really like to get into doing some vlogs again which should be really exciting. So, well I say really exciting, as exciting as vlogs can be when you're like not 100% but I, I just really want to get back into it and I really want to start filming again like I said I've really missed you all and I've really 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 missed filming and if you were one of the people that sent me messages while I was away like saying you missed my videos or asking if I was okay thank you so much that means the absolute world to me it's so nice to hear from people and know that you were looking out for my videos and that you noticed that I wasn't there, so thank you. Right, let's go get set up in the makeup room and we will get into the Cherries haul. Before we actually get into like the haul and I set things up properly, this is the box that the haul came in and I just wanted to show you because I liked the paper on top. It's got the little cherries on it, which I thought looked really cute. Cherries. <laughs> Anyway, let's get to it. So, as I mentioned before, this part of the video, um, the products in this part of the video were very kindly gifted to me from Cherries. So if you haven't heard of Cherries, which I'm sure you might have done because I've seen a few unboxings um, and Cherries hauls going around YouTube recently, it's a shopping app or you can shop via the website. And it's all about saving money on everyday essentials from personal care, um, household essentials, there is all sorts there. There's even things for like your garden and your home. There is so, so much choice. If I said to you that it was, it reminded me of like a B&N kind of shop um, where everything is really, really competitively priced. Oh my God, that's my stomach rumbling if you can hear that. Ignore that, I'm doing intermittent fasting and you would have thought that after like I don't know how many months of doing it now, maybe seven, eight, maybe even more. My body would be more used to it by now, but no, we still have these little glitches. Anyway, 
So cherries, you can get all your household essentials from there, uh, body care, there's food, I've got food in my haul, definitely couldn't miss out on the food, <laughs> um, and it's all really competitively priced, so the prices are amazing for what you can get. So I sat and looked on this app for, god, hours, absolute hours, because I just couldn't choose what I wanted to get and there's that much to look through, and there's new things added all the time, so even if you go on and you don't see exactly what you want, check back again in a few days because they are constantly adding new items which is just fabulous so let's get into the haul and i will show you the products that i bought right what i'm going to do is i think i will just take the packaging out of the box and then i will show you like an overview of the box because it really excited me when it came to see it like that Ta -da! is straight and got all the snacks so in fact let's just go through it like this so that might be a nice way to show you um let me stop rattling before i pick this up this is 30 pounds worth from the shop i think i got it absolutely bang on to 30 pounds so this is like a good representation of where your 30 pounds will take you so the first things that i got were these fish and chips Bought and vinegar. These, if you haven't tried them, are so nice. They are so salty and vinegary. They are great. I actually got these for my mum because as soon as she saw these on the shop, she was like, oh God, I used to love those. I've not had them for ages. So I got these fish and chips, spot and vinegar baked snacks. They're really nice. A little fishy there. Quite cool. Next thing I got was these Tea Cakes Jammy Wagon Wheels because I thought these just sounded delicious and I really like the normal wagon wheels and when I saw they did a tea cake version, I really wanted to try it. I really like those Tunnocks Tea Cakes so I'm sure that I will really like these as well. Next, I got some Sun Essentials. So I got the Malibu Factor 50 SPF I always try and get Factor 50. My skin burns really easily in the sun and I also use um, acne treatment. I use Differin all the time or Adapalene, I think the other name for it is. So I always like to try and get good sun care. So I got two of those. These were really, really well priced as well. And they are 200 mils each. So you get like a really good amount in there. And then because I was getting stuff for um, being out in the sunshine, I wanted to get an after sun as well. So I thought I would try this one from Malibu. This is the Ice Blue Moisturising After Sun Gel. This smells really nice and it says that it's cooling and soothing. I think I'm actually going to lift my camera back up. It's making me feel a bit funny. I didn't mention it earlier on in the video, um, but one of the reasons why I've been away is because my heart's been a bit funny, so I don't want to do anything that's like too strenuous and getting that ticker going a bit funny again. So let me lift the box up on here and I will show you. I've been propping things up on glossy boxes, which I've got here. I've not got a very professional setup today, guys. It's been a bit of a trying to pull everything together and get organized. Let's try and do things in some kind of order. So we'll go back to the snacky bits first. So the next thing that I got was an absolute favorite in this house, which is Haribo Super Mix. I really like this one. I love the little jelly babies that are inside. I love Haribo jelly babies. They're my absolute favorite. They're not my like favorite sweet ever, but I mean out of like all the jelly babies. <laughs> I really like the Haribo ones, um, but these aren't actually for me, I got these for my dad because he absolutely loves these too. Then I got these to try, which are the Munchies cookie dough. When I was really little, I used to love Munchies and I remember my mum and dad always getting one of those like little packs like that, like in the little tube kind of thing. It's not a tube, but you know what I mean, it was like a long pack and I absolutely love these, so I thought yeah. I'll try these out and see what they are like. Next, I got this salted caramel flavour syrup from Skinny Sir. I don't know why I'm doing this as if I'm showing you a beauty product that won't focus. Um, I was really wanting to try something from um, Skinny Food Co. And I haven't actually gotten around to trying anything from them. So I thought if I get this, I think this is like a fail safe flavour to try first and see if I like. 
So um, this one is gluten free, fat free, zero calorie, vegan friendly, sugar free and diabetic friendly as well. I don't know if I mentioned or if you've seen anywhere, actually I've definitely not mentioned it on my channel because I haven't been here. Um, but over on my Instagram, which will be linked below, I mentioned that I'm trying to incorporate more vegan and vegetarian meals into my diet. I'm not going completely vegan or completely vegetarian, I'm just trying to slowly phase it out. Because if I go like really hard at it and try and cut everything out all at once, I don't think that I would end up sticking to it. I want to cut things out slowly and steadily. And I must say that I've noticed a massive difference. I think with all of my health problems this year, it's made me really sit back and reflect on what I'm eating, my lifestyle, the kind of things that I'm doing, like stress levels, everything like that. And going towards like more vegetarian and vegan side has been seriously helpful. So I'm really glad that this one is um, vegan friendly as well. It's just something else to add to my vegan food cupboard as it were. Um, the next product is a coconut oil but I'm actually using this as a beauty product. So I love using this as a moisturiser or as a hair mask before I wash my hair. Um, and this, the KTC one, is one of my favourite ones to use. It's just really good. It says odourless, but I'm sure that it... Oh, it's got, it's got a thing on it. I can't get it off at the minute, I don't think. Um, anyway, this one says odourless, but I'm sure the one I had before did actually smell like coconut, so we'll see. But you can also cook with these, but I do have a separate one for cooking. This one is just my beauty one. Uh, right, next let's go on to like homey stuff and essentials. Um, Zephora. I absolutely love Zephora and I love this scent, the Midnight Blooms one. It smells so nice. I always put this into a tall spray bottle with some water and I use it just to spray around the house to freshen everything up. Um, and obviously I use it for cleaning too, for like diluting and washing things down it just smells so nice and also I like putting this in the washing machine it makes your clothes smell amazing especially if you are washing your bedding so that is really nice um and then what else have I got that's like oh I'll show you what I got for Lily and Alfie which are my two long haired chihuahuas if you are new to this channel um I got these little doggy waste bags because obviously these are an essential you need to pick up after your pooches so these are really good value i think sometimes they can be quite expensive in other shops especially if you buy them from places like pets at home i can't remember exactly how much they were but they weren't expensive and quite like that they're this like pinky purpley color as well i'm sure lily and alfie will appreciate that um, next in the box, I got, well, next in the box, next in my haul, I got this. How cute. It's a little rhino. This is for Alfie's birthday. It's in August. Lily's birthday is in June, so this month, but she doesn't really get excited about toys anymore. So I wanted to get this for little Alfie, so he will absolutely adore this. Um, that's all I got for the puppies. Oh, hang on a minute guys, my battery's flashing at me. I'm not being a very good YouTuber today and haven't charged my battery enough. So stay there one second and let me change my battery. Hi, we're back again. I've had a hair change because it's driving me insane today and it's still not right, but I need to get on with this video. So the next few items are the beauty products that I picked up. Uh, standard head and shoulders for men. This is for my dad again, and I actually quite like using this as well. Um, this one is the, is it? Yeah, this is a soothing mint one, so it kind of tingles when it's on your scalp, which is really nice. Feels very nice and refreshing, especially on these very hot days that we are having, which I'm very glad about, by the way. Uh, next is hair bands, because if you're anything like me and you use hair bands, you take them out and then they seem to disappear. Same as like bobby pins or hair grips. 
Where did they all go? Because they just disappear and I never ever find them again. So I thought I would try these ones. I think these ones are like, they don't feel like they would really snag your hair, which I'm glad about because oh, my hair gets so luggy. I used to love that when I was little, like, oh, you've got lugs in your hair, get these luggies out. <laughs> anyway, hair bands, essential. Not exciting, but an essential. Um, next, I picked up this age defying sheet mask. Um, I love a good sheet mask and this one says it helps improve the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles and it's coenzyme Q10 and it's from Elysium Spa. So I love trying out different sheet masks. I find them a really nice way to like have a bit of a pamper and feel a bit more like refreshed and revitalised. And next on the beauty side, oh, so nice. I picked up this luxury shower gel, which is from Insignia, and it says party time. And the scent is tequila watermelon with lime extract. And it actually smells really, really nice. And of course it's pink, so I really liked it. But yeah, I thought that was something quite different to try. They had a few other um, different scents as well that were like different cocktail kind of scents. So I will probably try those again at some point. And then, last but not least, I picked up something that I've been really excited about because my dad hoovered my car the other day and he cleaned it all for me and it's really nice and clean inside and all I needed to finish it off was a nice new air freshener. So I got this one from Yankee Candle. This is their Kaja air freshener and this one is Seaside Woods, which is not a scent that I've ever tried before. So I hope that I like it because I'm quite fussy about car scents, believe it or not. I'm quite obsessive with my car in that respect. <laughs> anyway, I'm looking forward to trying that in the car. So that is my full cherries haul. I am so excited to use everything that I picked up and I'm really excited to eat my munches. So that'll be the first thing that I do when I finish filming this video is make a cup of tea or a coffee and sit down with my cookie dough munches which are just right there looking at me, inviting me in. I can't wait to try them. Before I sign off from this video let me give you the discount code details so you can get yourself onto the Cherries app and get yourself a bargain haul too. So guys, all you need to do is set up the Cherries app on your phone and when you get to the checkout, enter the code RACHELD20 which will give you 20% off your entire order. This is for your first time purchase only. So if you are a first time customer, you will be able to use my discount code and enjoy getting some pennies off your haul. So guys, thank you so much for watching my video. I'm really sorry if it was like a bit all over the place. I felt really nervous to film again today because it's been such a long time, um, but I'm looking forward to getting back into things. As I said, I'm not 100% yet. I'm still waiting on more tests and I'm waiting on an operation. So that will put me out of action for a little while again. Um, but maybe I'll be able to vlog in between or vlog some of the like, time that I'm recovering I don't know let me know what you guys want to see if you have any um like ideas on what you might like me to film let me know in the description box or if you have any like questions or anything that you want to know ask me in the description uh, not the description box in the comments I'm really open to talking about most things so yeah feel free to ask away anything that you like and let me know your video suggestions. So guys, I'm going to go now and enjoy some sunshine. Well, it's a bit dull, but hopefully it'll come back out again um, and make my drink and go and enjoy my munches and just relax for a little bit, which I'm looking forward to. So I hope you are having a lovely day, whatever you are up to, or a lovely evening if you're watching this in the evening time. And I will hopefully see you all again soon. Bye.